Welcome to speedearning.com. We are learning the trading in commodities. What should be the parameters to buy any script? So there are seven parameters. You can note it down and just watch in the real market. That will help you to decide easily. The first parameter is whether any script, any commodity is more than half percent plus if some commodity is less than half percent plus then it may take time to move further but if it is if it is moving more than half percent then uh, there may be a very fast movement so from half percent to one uh, percent or one and a half percent movement is very fast so we suggest you to see uh, whether any script is more than half percent the second thing is uh, is it above ATP or below ATP? For buying, it should be above ATP, average traded price. Where can you see the ATP? You just go to Odin software, whatever your trading, uh, your trading software is there. Uh, you can see ATP there. You can go to the market depth or snap code where buyers and sellers are shown. Uh, so beside that, you can see the average traded price. If you don't find uh, it there, then you can go to moneycontrol.com commodity section. Uh, you are seeing the prices of all the commodities there gold, silver, copper, nickel, lead, zinc, crude, NG, and menthol oil. So if you are clicking on the particular commodity, you are seeing high, low, open, and ATP. ATP is also there. So you can see the ATP from there, and Money Control app is easily available on your smartphone and uh, you can operate it with a very good speed the third thing is uh, whether this script went to bottom in last three four days if uh, it has uh, gone to bottom in last three four days then it is safer to buy that particular script there may be sudden reversals so was there any big correction in last week that is a supporting thing for buying some script today because there may be reversals then fourth whole sector is in plus or whole sector is in green suppose if you are going to buy gold mini then whether the silver is also green if you are uh, thinking to buy copper then whether the nickel zinc and lead are also green if base metal is supporting then copper is suggested to buy there uh, if and uh, in case of energy crude and natural gas are uh, not supporting each other very clear so you can uh, think independently in case of ng and crude then fifth thing is buyers are increasing I am not telling you that whether the buyers are more or less. I am telling you whether the buyers are increasing. You just clear it. Uh, suppose buyers are 5000 and sellers are 10,000. But after 5 minutes you see buyers are 6000 and sellers are reducing to 9000. Then buyers are going to in, uh, increasing to 7000 and sellers are coming to 8000. Then you can see clearly that buyers are increasing and sellers are decreasing. So that is a good thing for buying some script. So that should be very clear. And then sixth parameter. If there is range broken in chart. Range means the range between uh, recent high and low there may be a range sideways movement and buyers or sellers are fighting together fighting each other and uh, they are trying to pull the market down or they are pulling the market upside so if resistance is broken resistance the upside uh, of the range then buying is supported so you just see if in chart the resistance is broken R1 or R2 resistance 1 resistance 2 that we we shall discuss in uh, your technical analysis phone classes but right now if the upper range is broken that is supporting the buying then uh, seventh thing is suitable time slot 
suppose uh, there are some suitable time slot what we have discussed with you so in case of commodities 1 to 3 may be a suitable time in noon and uh, 6 to 8 may be a suitable time for evening so suppose if all those parameters are supporting and you are entering into the trade after 3 and before 6 then there may be confusion and uh, there may be um, a range bound movement and uh, less clear movement whatever you had expected uh, with all these parameters because time slot is not supporting there are some particular time slots which are showing good movement in evening uh, the global markets are opening and in afternoon uh, there may be the timing for some important data so that's why those are the timings when we, we can see uh, the particular movement in scripts so just go for suitable time slots and eighth parameter is the technical uh, summary in suggested websites we have suggested you some websites which are very simple to understand and you have uh, you have gone through all the parameters you have seen everything but those technical indicators will assure you to take your step so these are eight parameters uh, which can be seen before buying any script in commodity market you just keep practicing and uh, we are discussing every day over the phone when we are discussing over the phone you are seeing directly the data and websites so that is the best possible training model and so many trainees are getting benefit from that uh, training model thank you very much keep suggesting us give feedbacks bye